Hi, this is Angela Kristen Taylor with the Limitless Collaborative here to give you a little tour of our uh, virtual community. So this is where you actually land when you first get into the uh, into the community. You can see we have uh, Jessica is here sitting at the information desk. She's the person uh, that you can uh, well, not, it's not always Jessica, but <laughs> whoever is sitting at that information desk can help you with questions, tech support, things like that, uh, help direct you to where you're going to go if you're here for an event or if you're here to co-work or what have you. So uh, just to give you an example, so if you hit your space bar, um, if you hit your space bar, you can look around and kind of wherever you're pointing your mouse, you're going to be able to look around and see around you. Uh, you can see we have our go to menu here and in our go to we have the options of the different places that we can visit here in the community. The arrow means that there is a sub menu. So if you click on that arrow, you will see the sub menus here and uh, here and uh, every space in here is walkable. But just so you know, this is uh, the quick way to move around and get from where you're going. Now, if you click on your own name, you'll see um, I actually have some extra features as an admin, but you'll have features to set yourself away or uh, change yourself back to normal. You also have the ability to do things like raise your hand, put your hand back down and view your own avatar. So if you want to see what you look like and then do things like clap or cheer or wave at somebody. So lots of different options here uh, for moving around and doing things here in the space. Now you can also change your avatar. When you do that, that's where you come into the dressing room here. So you have options to change gender or headwear, hairstyles, eye color, eyeshadow. Uh, your glasses or, or shades, a uh, lip color, all these different things that you can change uh, in this space. And then you can also rotate the camera so you can see yourself from behind. You can just roll the dice to say random, randomize me for today. Uh, and then you can cancel your changes or when you're done, just save and exit. And then that'll take you back out to the welcome area. So just as a, like I said, just a quick overview. Um, if you wanna turn your mic on, that's how you do that. There is a public chat here where you can type, click an emoji or upload a file for others to download. And that same uh, chat box is available in various uh, room. It's, it's, it's available everywhere, but you'll see there will be a private chat box if you enter into anything um, that's in a blue circle, which means that's a private volume. So from having a seat here, no one else uh, in the community would be able to hear me speak except for other people around this table. And of course, I'd have to turn my microphone on to be able to do that. Uh, this chat box for private volume is specific to the people at this table as well. Stand up, sit down, easy peasy. And if you mouse over a certain seat, you'll be able to click to sit and it will change your seat there as well. The little map over here does tell you where you're at at any given time. You can zoom in there or zoom back out. And at any of the screens in the space, if you are a teaching member, you will have access to manipulate these screens. So I ask that you do not do that for these two screens up here at front, um, but you will be able to mouse through. Anybody can mouse through and see what is on. I say mouse through, I mean scroll through and see what's on uh, any given screen. But if you are a teaching member, you are able to uh, put in any uh, website that you would like, upload a file to the screen, share your screen, or turn your webcam on and then share that webcam. So that is any screen anywhere in the space. So ordinarily you will be doing that in rooms that you're in. Uh, when you're teaching or hosting an event. So there are lots of uh, spaces throughout our community here. And you can see all the rooms are walkable, like I mentioned, or you can just use the go to menu. A quick little hack, if you're getting bored of walking, you can hit the shift and your forward arrow key and you will run. This is our soccer field. And you can kick the soccer ball. And then you can also walk down, oops, 
totally missed the stairs there. <laughs> you can also walk down to the beach. You can kick the beach ball. You can drive the boat. going to do that because if you have seen me play Mario Kart, which I doubt you have, <laughs> you would know how bad I am at that. <laughs> ah, where'd I go? I'm stuck on the boat. There we go. <laughs> and yes, you can walk through the water. There are lots of little outdoor areas where you can connect um, and have a private conversation. With others, uh, you'll notice that the background sound does disappear when you uh, leave and walk into a private area. Uh, you can also go to our TLC center where there is quite a few uh, various little conversation areas like this one. Again, private area. And in here, and this, this is actually a four story building in every building. Our, every floor in the building has its own little little conversation area. So it's a great spot to sit and connect with other people here in the community. So that is just a quick overview, like I said, of our, of our little campus here and what we're doing in this space. And I hope that you enjoyed that and stay tuned to check out other uh, rooms. We have uh, some more videos coming up here with specific rooms like our auditorium, our theater, things like that. So, but this is an overview of the campus. Hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you soon inside of the Limitless Collaborative.